Hello guys, welcome back to my Shenmue Let's Play. In the last episode, we rescued Nozomi from the Mad Angels at the harbour, and Ryo made a promise to the Mad Angels boss, Terry, to beat up Guizan Chen, who is Master Chen's son, and Ryo has to beat him up tomorrow evening. So let's get to sleep and let's head to the next day. I'm not looking forward to this. Zomi is fine. Had to promise Terry I'd beat up Chen Guizan. Tomorrow night at 10pm, go to warehouse number 9. This is going to be a setup. I just know it. Ten thirteen AM. Wow, Rio's late at the harbour today. Tom, hey Rio, working hard at the harbour today. Yeah. What's wrong? You seem kind of blue. No, I'm all right. Okay. Tell you what. You come on by later, and let me treat you to lunch, okay? Young man, have a seat. Sure. I'm sorry, but I'm gonna have to ask you to resign. Am I fired? Yeah, I'm afraid so. Why? Uh, you see, there's been a mess of trouble since you started. Now, I know it ain't all your fault, but, well... And? When trouble starts affecting my company, that's a problem. You know what I mean. Yes, I understand. Thank you for everything. Mm. So Rio is fired, that's why he was late at the harbour today. Although he wasn't going to know that, was he, until just now. Maybe Rio had permission to get some extra sleep. Oh, I don't know. Anyway, Tom said he was going to treat us to lunch, so he might as well go get some lunch early. Getting fired has put me in a bad mood. I love driving a forklift in this game. Some coffee, okay? I don't feel like coffee today. Hey, Rio, look! <laughs> Tom, what was that leg move? A friend taught me this. It's a tornado kick. You want me to teach you? Yeah, that's a satisfying move. I'd love to know how to do it. Yeah, teach me. It's your lucky day! First, the music! <laughs> First, I'll teach you the steps. You watch carefully, okay? Step forward, step again, then kick, okay? Very simple, okay? First, try the steps. You take two steps toward me. Okay? Sure. Okay, man, nice steps. Next, after the second step, kick. 
Now Rio, you try it, okay? This is actually a really satisfying move to pull off. Okay, very good. Pretty good for the first time. But that's just like you, Rio. Thanks, Tom. No, no, no. This is how it's done, okay? Hmm? Two steps forward then. First and kick. second kick. This is the real tornado kick. Now Rio, you try it, okay? Alright. First kick, then another kick. Oh. There we go. Got it. This move is so satisfying to pull off when you're when you're fighting people. Pretty my favorite yeah, move in the game actually. Perfect. You got the rhythm now! Thanks, Tom. The tornado kick is very powerful, okay? This kick is perfect for when you're surrounded by multiple opponents. Do you want to practice longer? Nah, I think I've got it, Tom. Thanks, man. No, that's okay. Okay! You mastered the leg move great. You're a good teacher, Tom. Thanks. What's wrong? Um... I got something I need to tell you, Ryo. Tell me what? Tomorrow, I go back to America. What? All of a sudden? Not suddenly. I've been planning to for a while. Tom. Ryo, why are you going on your trip? Uh, I... I bet it has something to do with your father. Yeah, I thought so. Me? I'm going back to my home. And you'll be leaving soon too. Nobody can stop you. Tom. Even though we part ways, you'll still be one of my best friends. You're mine too. Mm. 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 Today's the last day for Tom's hot dogs. Get them while you can. Yeah, I'll have one. Leg move tornado kick has been mastered. Oh, I love this move. Tom's going back to America. Aww, I like Tom. My friend. Tom. It's now night time. Oh, this means we're going to have to fight Guizan. Oh, I'm not looking forward to this. I don't trust Terry. I actually don't. Why would Rio trust him in the first place? To be fair, this does lead up to a really cool fight, though. I'm here. You sure got guts coming here. This way. Follow me. Wait here. Is Guizong coming here? He passes through here on his way home from work. Hmm. Here he comes. I'm out of here. Azuki, why are you here? Guizong, I want to fight you. What? What are you talking about? Ready? What? Okay, this is leads to a pretty cool fight though. Fighting Guizan, but this is not the cool part of the fight. Once we are in 
Guizana settled their fight. It leads to the 70 man battle, which is probably one of my favourite fights in gaming. Guizana, pretend to lose. Say what? Terry will take me to land D. You trust a punk like Terry? You know, I don't understand why Rio trusts Terry. I mean, come on, he's a bad guy and all this. Why would Rio trust him? Come on, Rio should know that Terry wouldn't take him to Land D. Is Landy still even in Japan right now? You'd be better yeah, off that's it. Tornado kick. Thanks, Tom. You? Go down before you get hurt. Oh, I love this. Tornado kick is such a is such a cool cool move to use. It's probably one of my favorites to use in the game, actually. Aside from the punching and the kicking, the casual moves. Oh, I can try it. Right, here we go. Yeah, oh, I missed him. To be fair, I was a bit far too far away from him. Ah. How long is this fight going to go on for? What? By a kick like that? Huh. You call that a kick? Huh. Huh. The fight's not over yet. You'll see the cool part of the fight in a minute, the 70 man battle where Ryo and Guizan pee up the Mad Angels. Probably one of my favourite fights in gaming. I probably wouldn't say it's my favourite fight in gaming, but definitely my favourite fight in so Shemmy. You aren't? You're on! Bring now Guizan on. and Ryo are seriously trying to fight now. <sighs> Alright, Hazuki. Well, come on! You know, you're not too bad. Uh, nor you. It's my lucky day. I'll get rid of both of you at one time. Just as I suspected. Hey, can you move? Uh, let's settle our dispute later. You're on. That's low, Terry. I will make you pay. <laughs> you like me that much? Let me invite you to hell. Wait! <laughs> Is trouble your middle name? Save your complaints for later. Fine. Watch yourself. You too. <sighs> this is where the fun begins. You may have noticed that the music has changed slightly. I actually quite like this music. It's quite cool. I've used this music quite a few times in my end card for some of my videos. Ah. Probably my favourite music in Shemu, this is the final boss, the final, the 70 man battle music. Easily my favourite music in Shemu. Although this game has such a good soundtrack, it was so difficult to me to pick my favourite music. Shemu 2 as well has a great soundtrack, I'll point out which soundtracks are great in Shemu 2 as well when I play for it after this game. It's actually quite surprising how easy the Mad Angels are to take out, despite people saying how tough they are in the start of the game, but... So far they don't look that tough. Looks like Rio and Guizana making this look really easy to beat them up so far. I'm gonna take you out. Don't hit me with a barrel fight. Fair. Oh, I just need kicked Guizan. Well, if I did kick Guizan. You're pretty good. Okay, we've got some big guys coming now. Bring it on! Oh, I love this part of the game. This is easily my favourite part in Shemmy. The forklift part was great, but it was a shame I got fired. Although getting fired's worth it in my opinion just to, to play through this fight. And the good thing about this fight as well is that this is the only part of the game in Shemmy with replay value. Once you beat the game, you'll have to restart the whole game again, all the way back to where Rio's father was murdered. Oh, Luckily, once you beat the game, you can actually replay the 70-man battle, which is actually pretty cool. I might replay this... As this is such a cool fight, I might replay this battle again afterwards in a video just to show you guys 70 man battle again, just because I love this battle that much. It's so cool. I love the 70 man battle. 
This is the only part of the game you'll get to replay once you've beaten the game. You know, that doesn't really matter, because this is the best part of the game, so it doesn't really bother me that much. This is the only part that you can replay. So you might as well, you might as well do it again. Once I've beaten the game, I'm going to show you guys the bad ending of the game as well, and I might replay the 70-man battle again, because why not? We all know how much I love the 70-man battle. I've said it quite a few times this Let's Play, I think. Yeah, how much I love the 70-man battle. Let's get it on. Probably the best fight in Shemu. When you beat this fight, though, you know you're leading up toward the end of the game, though. Once you've beaten this part of the game, you can easily replay this battle anytime you want, the 17-man battle. If you go to the main menu, you'll see a new game, continue options, and then a new icon will appear saying 17-man battle. Just click on that, and then we'll take you straight to this fight, pretty much. These Mad Maddows aren't so tough. Why are people in the harbour so scared of them? Ryo and Guzan are making this look really easy. Hey, you okay? Shut up! Okay, Guzan, calm down. I was just wondering if you were okay. Oh god, this guy's got a bat. Watch out for this guy because he, when he hits you with a bat, he can take away quite a bit of your health. So do be careful. This is the guy, when I've played the Central Man Battle, this was the guy that managed to take me out quite a few times because he can chip away my health quite easily because he's carrying a bat. This is the guy you really need to look out for when you get to this part. Fall to the floor. Stay I am staying focused. This is the guy who really chipped away my health and I'm really losing health right now. Ouch. You gone, I just need a bit more of my health to come up. Ah, I'm going to take you out. Come on. Come on, fall to the floor. Ah, oh, crap. You son of a bitch. Okay, bring it on. Where are you? You're the guy that took me out last time. Where is he? There he is. I really need to pick up to his back and really chip away health. Need to get him while I have the chance. Ah. If I try to grab him, maybe if I try to take his bat away. I don't know if I can do that, right. I'm going to try using some throwing techniques, see if that works. Ah. Come here. Let me finish you off. I haven't lost much health this time, though, from this guy. Good sign. I don't know if it's possible to avoid the bats. Every time I press a triangle button when he swings, he doesn't. Hey, you okay? Every time I try to block his bat attacks, I never succeed in blocking him. Maybe they, they can't be impossible to block. Surely maybe I'm just not pressing the triangle button at the right time. Okay, the guy with the bat is down now. I just need to deal with him. I'm not sure how many men I've taken out. I think that's got at least 50 odd men now. Of the mad angels I've taken out. Okay, who's next? Ah. The flying kick is such a good move. It takes out but all the mad angels literally in one kick. Most of them anyway. If you want to beat this fight so quickly, that's the best way to do it. This swing kick. Just run, then press the X button, and then Rio will take them out. Of course, some mad angels are stronger than that. They caught like the guy with the bat and the big guy with the green coat. This guy looks quite tough. I need to be careful. Hope he doesn't do too much of my health. Right, I'm, I'm seriously cornered here. Where's Gui's arm when you need him? Gui's arm, where are you? I need your help here. Ah. Come on, Gui's arm, where are you? Is he just making me do all the work here? Guizan, where are you? I need to fight another mad angel somewhere, I don't know. I could really use his help with this guy though. This guy is a big guy. I'm surprised we can fight. I'm surprised this guy is taking damage. There's a bit there's an even bigger guy you get to fight in Shemu 2 with this guy. There's a really big fat guy you get to fight, and I'll show you guys hit that, that guy when we play Shemu 2. 
Now, I'm pretty sure if you play Shenmue 2, you know who I'm talking about. That really big guy in China. Who want who's works for Master Landy? I'll show you. I'll show you guys. I can't remember his name actually. A quite a funny name. You, I think you'll, you'll think you'll know who I'm talking about if you play Shenmue 4. But if you haven't, I'll show you guys who that guy is when we get to Shenmue 2. When we get to that part of the game. Where the hell is Guizan? Where is Guizan when you need him? Come on, surely your health must be gone now. Guizan, I could use your help right here. I don't hear any other mad angels around. Where the hell has Guizan gone? Has he ditched me? Okay, guess I'll take this guy on myself. How much health does this guy have? He has more health than the guy with the bat. Get to the floor. That's it. Is he gone? No, nope, he's getting back up. Wow. This guy sure loves a fight. There we go. Is he dead? Yes! Well, he's down at least. Mm. Azuki, stand back. This one is mine. Just who the hell you think you're dealing with? Yeah. Fight fair, man. I'll take this. Gotta learn to fight fair. You're left. Yeah. Terry's down. You'll pay for this, Terry. Now, where is Landy? Never give up, do you? Tell me! That creepy scared. He took him out to the ship. What? Too bad. You want him that bad? You better start swimming. Damn. <laughs> After all that, still didn't get Landy. You're going after him? Well, I just can't give up. But how can I? I'll talk to my father. Hmm? I'll ask my father to help you out. Really? Contact me later, okay? Guizan. What? Thank you. No. That's my line. Yosan, I was waiting for you. What's up, Fuxan? I have something for you. Huh? This. It's father when he was young. Who's that with him? I have no idea. Never seen him before. Fuxan, where'd you get it? Found it in the basement. Really? Why would he keep this down there? Well, night, Ryosan. Night. So after all that, Rio still did still not get to land D. Come on, why do Rio want to trust Terry like that? Surely Rio must have known not to trust the boss of the Mad Angels. Okay, guys, I'm going to end the episode off here. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode. We hope you guys enjoyed it. If you enjoyed the episode, please be sure to leave a like on the video. That means so much to me. And if you want to keep updated with all the Shenmue videos, I'd like to my channel. Please join us for make subscribe. Make my day so much better. And the next episode will be the finale, where we will finally get a boat to Hong Kong. And you'll get to chase after Landy. 
Rio is not going to give up just yet. Landy, I'm coming for you. If you guys think guys so much for watching this episode, I'll see you guys in the finale. This is GoldieX and I'm out.